One cancer patient is not letting her disease define her. Instead, she's using her love of Legos to spread joy to other people who may have health-related issues. St. Louis 11's James Atherley has the story. It's not the priority right now. Building the other sets is. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but just a few sets. Mm -hmm. <laughs> My daughter didn't give me fair warning it was rainy season. <laughs> um, so we started building Legos. Creve Corps resident in, Jen Seitz calls herself the Lego girl. She spends hours upon hours putting sets together like this Lego Star Wars Millennium Falcon. She started building after visiting her daughter in Florida in March. I was like, these are neat. And so I started sending some sets back to myself here. Seitz has come to love Legos, especially as a distraction. Since last November, she's been dealing with health issues, starting with seizures, then intestinal cancer. It was March of this year that we discovered the tumors in my abdomen. Um, and I've been going through treatment with that. She says she's built over a thousand friendship flowers. She gives them to fellow patients at the hospital and that lifts her spirits. I'm finding so much joy doing Legos and keeping my mind busy. Why wouldn't I help impact other people and give them some brightness and color and hope? She says she wants friendship flowers in every home. It's a little tiny set of brightness and color and happiness and joy. Lego hired sites to build display sets like you see in your favorite Lego stores. So you're going to pay me to do what I'm already sitting on the sofa doing. Kind of sounds like a pretty good gig. In Creve Corps, James Atherley, St. Louis 11 News.